stop Can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time Morning, evening and midnight Such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I Expected love was found You're the rose in a garden Good morning happy peoples Hope you guys are doing fantastic Today's the last day in the old AZ So I thought why not give you a tour of the uh old Airbnb that we stayed at Because we've been saying in the last like three videos that we were gonna show you guys So we wanted to show you because this was an outstanding place to stay. Here, just getting ready to head off to the airport. Everything is packed up, ready to go. So you come in, front door, front door here. It's got it's some very awesome charms about it. So you've got a living room here, then you've got a formal dining over yonder. Little, little house cleaner money card. We weren't sure if they were able to take cash or anything, so we, we left them a gift card so they wouldn't, they wouldn't necessarily get in trouble if they couldn't take cash, so. That also connects in here with just like a kind of another little like family room area, which was awesome. These recliners are super comfy. Then you have another like little breakfast nook, which we turned into our office. So we had our computers and all the all the things set up in here. Kitchen, not a huge kitchen, but perfect for what we needed. A little laundry room here, which I did use uh, twice. I did laundry here, which was super convenient. Then there's like this big den area which was phenomenal uh it's like a fun game room area um the guys came when they got all ready for the wedding this is where they were able to get ready and we were able to close off this door and section it off from the rest of the house it was awesome and to this side of the house lots of closets lots of storage um then we've got the master bedroom i haven't made the bed yet but master, it's got two full walk-in closets, a uh, bathroom, not super huge of a bathroom, one sink, but all the amenities, we, it was perfect. It was perfect for what we needed. Tons of storage. There's all this storage here. We kept all of our video equipment in. We have that all storage. I mean, it was, there was so much, so much. And then having the kiddos have their own rooms was phenomenal. So this is where Audrey stayed. Hasn't made her bed yet either. Um, oh, Garrett's Rock. Can't forget that. Then we've got walk-in closets in all of the bedrooms, which was awesome to be able to store suitcases and stuff. Evelyn's bedroom, which you guys have seen this one. She did make her bed because that's Evelyn. <laughs> had the uh, walk-in closet here. She had her own TV and storage. It was awesome for them to have like their own little space. And Garrett generally shared with Audrey, but sometimes he actually came in with us too. Little bathroom um, with a tub, full-size tub, which Garrett took a lot of baths in. Sink, toilet area. Perfect, perfect. I think this is like over 2,000 square foot of a home. So huge. We did not need this much space, but it sure was nice, especially having the bridal party over here to get ready. It was phenomenal. Then, let me show you. So you saw the, uh, den area this room here that was sectioned off then you come out here oh my word you come out here and there's like a full blown patio set huge yard and the best thing a swing set absolutely love this this was awesome go ahead oh my word oh my word okay please don't fall we could do crazy yeah, I know. I can see that. I'm going to miss the sunshine, guys. But a huge yard. There's even a volleyball uh, net. It's got all this storage area. So, like, if you had to bring maybe an RV, you can pull that right in. It was awesome. We were running around like crazy people. Um, I don't, I think we could have utilized it a lot more if we were just, like, stationary and not, you know, just coming in for a visit or something. And not having to run so much, but I mean, that's kind of what you do on vacation, right? It was perfect for what we needed. Even had a grill set, which was pretty awesome. Um, they even had an extra propane tank, which was awesome. They had extra salt here in case we needed to put it into our filter or for our water system. This one connects 
connects this way into a two car garage. How stinking cool! And then the front yard is beautiful. It's like a whole, I mean, it's not like you're in a really, a really close proximity. Um, oh my gosh, if I touch my hair one more time. Not in like a really, really close proximity neighborhood, which we're not used to at all. Um, so you're kind of out. I mean, you are by a main road, but it has a circular drive. It was phenomenal, guys. To look up Casagaran Airbnbs. Um, Sandra is the owner of this Airbnb. Absolutely loved it. So anyway, we are gonna hit the road. Whoa, it's windy. We're gonna hit the road, head on over to my parents, say goodbye to all them. My mom is coming with us back. So that will be kind of fun. We're gonna have another travel buddy. I'm gonna finish up some of the stuff here and we're gonna head off to Alaska. I missed it. I missed home. I'm ready to get back. So let's head that way. I think that's oh, it. My purse and everything's in here? Yep. Okay, let's see how fast I can run. Okay. Three, two, one. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah. Got this. Bye house. We wake. Hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Oh, we know what we have. Let's hold on tight. All right, let's roll. Get over here, Mom, because she's going to be on the same plane with us. Getting everything wrapped up last minute. Quick food. We're on the road. I'm going to take Evelyn with me because we can't all fit in the same rig. I've got a rental car, lots of luggage, and now an extra person. So we are going to, Evelyn, you're gonna go with me, right? Yeah. Okay, all right, let's get to the rental car place. See you later. You ready to go? Watch that interstate, the intersection right there, right? Uh -huh. Where you wait. Always. It's Everything's fine. Be good boys. You have to depend on each other now. Oh, okay. Bye. Okay, bye. Try not to drop my dog. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. See you later. Bye. 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 Love you. All right. Letting the old car go. Hello, a whole bunch of them. Good in the plane, huh? Yep. Those bands work good? Maybe. Maybe it's the bands. I appreciate Thank it. Alright, made it to Seattle. That was a 
a decent experience. I, I think it's about the same as the last time I was flying, Alaska Airlines at least. Um, they have all the middle seats open, and except if they're like in your same party, and they also have uh, uh, HEPA filters. You don't have to have masks on here just walking around in the terminal. So now Alaska has a little bit of a higher uh, standard here. So when we get into Alaska, um, you have to be tested there. Well, there's two different ways you can do it. Number one is you can show up with a test that is negative within three days, or you can do our option, which if you are a resident of Alaska, you can just show up and they will uh, test you right there and you have to quarantine until your test comes back, which I feel is a little bit more thorough, if you will, because within three days you can pick something up. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna show you guys that whole process, but um, that's been a good trip. Um, Thank you guys, by the way, your suggestions with Audrey. Uh, you guys mentioned wristbands and like patches and all kinds of stuff. We got those bands and it was night and day. So that was awesome. Those bands really seemed to work and we gave her extra Dramamine early. So she had no problems. We'll see how this next flight is though. Thank you so much, appreciate it. You got your uh, travel declaration done, sir? No. I'll pull up your phone, pull up your phone camera, act like you're gonna take a picture of that barcode, but don't take a picture, it'll pop up a URL. You click on that, make an account the state portal, and then uh, once you've made that account, log in, and on the top part of that, that page, it'll say new travel declaration, and that's the form you need to fill out. Okay. And Fantastic. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Cool. Oh, that would be awesome. Yeah. Okay. Are you gonna do it to me? Oh yes, I will. Yeah. Okay. Unless you want to do it yourself. How far do I have to go up? It's only gonna go about half inch to an inch. Yep. I could try it by myself, and then you tell me if I need to go farther. That that sounds fair. Does that okay. Work? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, since it's a shallow nasal swab, it's gonna be ten seconds each nostril. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, you're welcome to cough, sneeze, laugh, cry. Okay, this is a safe place. Okay. <laughs> I do have Phoenix and hand sanitizer oh, okay. waiting for you, okay? okay? All right, Jessica. So that Q-tip, right in there. Am I just doing one nostril or both nostrils? You're gonna do both nostrils both for 10 nostrils. seconds each, okay? Yeah, okay. All right. Here we go. Yep, give it a little twirl. Good depth. Thanks so much. Thanks for the encouragement. You're welcome. All right, now you can switch to the other nostril. Excellent. That's good. That should be good. Sweet. Thank you. That's a good sample right there. All right. <laughs> All right. We come back by email in roughly three to five business days. Okay. Now, Jessica, it is important for you to remember that if it is positive, you will get a phone call from the health care official. Okay. okay. All right. Um, any questions for me? I don't think so. No? That's well, it. again, congratulations. You went all of 2020 without a COVID test. And now you're starting 2021 with one. With, with one. All right. Let's hope we don't have to do this again in 2022. <laughs> That's what we're hoping for. All awesome. Right. Thank Take you care. so much. Good, Good job, Mom. Oh, yeah. Home sweet home. Testing is done. Now, stepping out into a completely different environment from earlier today on the I-10. And I'm going to go start the car. I had one of our friends went and dropped a car, our car off over here. Oh, there it is. Right there. But... We need to let it warm up for at least a half hour before we get in here, especially Nina's, I'm sure, already acclim acclimated to Arizona. Heavier, but I do my best to bring Dreams of green and filled with this Life is so much more than this So where do you go when nothing's like tired voice because it's 2 a.m. and technically it's 4 a.m. where we came from because two hours difference. Anyway, that was a ordeal at the old airport there trying to get 
back into the state is very challenging. Me and my husband are all tested up. We're gonna be quarantining here until we get our test results, which should be in the next three to five days. First time I ever did COVID testing, he said I did a really good job. He let me do it by myself, so that was pretty awesome. Look, you guys are still all here, and we still have more to put up. <laughs> so we're still very much in vlogmas mode here. Tree's still up, all the things. Anyway, um, did over here one of the passengers say that they paid $500 for a COVID test. It was a husband and wife and they had to pay $500 to get a COVID test done at the airport. With that in mind, if you guys are traveling here, uh, you might get it done. If you're not a resident, get it done before you come, which I'm thinking you probably can get a lot cheaper in your state. Um, it was free for Alaskan residents. Wait, these kiddos are exhausted. One's already in bed. She already like beeline to her bed. She's getting ready to go to bed and this one fell asleep on the couch again from the car to the couch. Anyway, thank you guys so much for coming along with us as we traveled back here to Alaska. <laughs> the whole trip feels like a whirlwind. It was definitely a work trip. We really didn't get to do much fun things, but we were able to help with wedding prep, bridal shower prep, all things prep. <laughs> but it was a good time and it was neat being able to see the family be at my sister's wedding, so that was awesome. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.